Welcome back to 10 Slide Info. In today's video, we are back with another set of three latest and trending defense and aviation updates. Defense Update 1 Solar Industries subsidiary Economic Explosives Limited has won a contract in March 2024 to supply 30,000 units of the multi-mode hand grenade to the Central Reserve Police Force. The unique feature of the multi-mode hand grenade is the ability to easily switch between offensive and defensive modes by removing or attaching a fragmenting sleeve before throwing. Coming to safety, the grenade's modular construction, consisting of a fuse and a main body, allows for easy priming and unpriming without compromising the effectiveness of the grenade. The success of Economic Explosives Limited in securing this contract highlights their position as a leading manufacturer of advanced military equipment in India. Defense Update 2 South Korea's Defense Acquisition Program Administration has officially approved the production of the KF-21 fifth-generation fighter jet, and this marks a significant step forward for the nation's aerospace industry. The program is budgeted at $5.9 billion spread over 2024 and 2028. Initial plans were for manufacturing 40 jets, but later it was reduced to initial production of 20 for additional testing needs for some key systems. When we say the testing of key systems, it is said to be relevant to the indigenously developed active electronically scanned array radar and also air-to-air -air missile capability. Despite the staggered approach in acquiring the first set of 40 KF-21 fighter jets, the overall program timeline remains on track. The Republic of Korea Air Force expects to receive the first KF-21 jet by the latter half of 2026. Defense Update 3 the Indian Coast Guard ship Samudra Paharidar, a specialized pollution control vessel, is currently in the Philippines as part of an overseas deployment to ASEAN countries, including Vietnam and Brunei. The ship arrived at Manila Bay on March 25, 2024, for a three-day visit, and this deployment aims to showcase India's expertise in marine pollution response and strengthen cooperation with maritime agencies in the ASEAN region. This Indian Coast Guard ship is equipped with advanced anti-pollution tools and a Cheetok helicopter specifically configured for oil spill response. This deployment highlights shared concerns and commitment in combating marine pollution. So, that was a small video to provide three latest and trending defense and aviation updates. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned to Tenslide Info for more such updates and analysis on defense and aviation. Thank you.